one is about keeping it simple. I spent a large part of my career training and delivering presentations and um, flooding people with information because they got to know everything. Oh my God, what happens if they don't know? And now that I'm running solo, I've got the autonomy to design the material in the way that I think is most ready to be digested. And so what that means is I cut out all of the little extra minutia that I know is true and, and people need to know. But if it's day one, I really just need to give them the big rocks, help them get an understanding of the core fundamentals that all of the other stuff is based upon. So I did that. I went through and I created a nice, super simple. And as I was creating it, the question I asked was, what did I retain the very first time I was introduced to the stuff? And maybe I'm slow, but it wasn't a whole lot, but there were some big chunks. And so that was what I delivered. And the feedback was awesome. The team clearly was able to digest the information and then they demonstrated their understanding and, and applying it. And then the conversation became all the little minutia, all the little critical, maybe not critical, but all the little things that happened that they need to be taken into consideration. They now had a basis of knowledge to ask more meaningful questions that were relevant to their experience. And so here's the question is when you're teaching people or when you're developing the capabilities of, of your team members, do you teach from a beginner's perspective or are you flooding them with information that you've learned and acquired over the years? Be cool and we'll talk at you next time. Peace.